You. Yes, you. I, I wasn't doing nothing. Thomas Jefferson needs someone to get this cart of food to hungry people. To sell it? Give it. Free food for hungry folks? I'm your man, friend. Get some friends. We will take as many cartloads as we can. I'm sure I was gonna make it out alive, but goddamn, this is the most fun I've had all week. Thomas Jefferson, people! This here food is thanks to Mr. Thomas Jefferson! Thomas Jefferson! Just a few carrots, and he has won their loyalty.
What was that? My friend Paul Revere disappeared three days ago. This soldier just confirmed the disappearance of his wife and son as well. I am sorry. Revere was an able and valuable man. He was endeavoring to loosen the blue coat grip on the city. Neighborhood by neighborhood, he was winning the people's trust and support. I will take up Revere's work to help rally the city. If the citizens fight for us, we will replace Washington with a new leader. This country must be led by the people. Make short work of you! Got him fighting! Tell the truth, damn it! Tell the truth, damn it!
Washington is giving a speech. We may be able to get an idea of the size of his forces. Come with me. Citizens of the United States, I come before you, a humbled man. As I look out upon this vast land, I see each of you suffering. Yes, suffering and striving for a better life, a better future, a better America. Each one of you sacrificing, slaving for this great country, for freedom. And I humbly say to you, your sacrifices inspire me. They shall not be in vain. I know this life is difficult. The ravages of war, food shortages, crime, the burdens caused by Jefferson's seditious murderers. But we, we have a greater purpose that will unite us and lift us above these trifling troubles. For us, the obliteration of these rebels will be but a foretaste of the feast to come. Citizens, as I stand here, I feel the four million hearts of our nation beating within my breast. Today, I announce the great project of this nation. We are mastering vast armies. We are fashioning powerful armadas. We shall soon march upon our great dark enemy, England! We shall invade her shores and irrigate her fields with blood. English bones shall provide grist for our mills and her people shall become our slaves. Each of you shall profit from the sweat of their labors. Our nation shall rise to its proper place as the greatest of all, the most sovereign kingdom, the United States of America! Tell the truth, damn it!
the truth, damn it. Get away from here. Fight for liberty! 